Hello and welcome back to Terraria. I'm setting my music now, I'm setting the volume a bit lower because we're going to listen to something a little bit more modern this time. I believe you've already had enough of the classical music, I guess. So let's put on something more completely different. Yes. I'm probably going to tell later where this is from. You have a observer right and know as I listen to not having to read common sections or anything. So as you can probably tell it's video game music. It's from a shooting game. Not the uh, regular kind, mind you, the uh, the insane Asian kind of shooting game. You know what I'm talking about. Right. Actually, there's also an MMO, it's um, called Valakru Sky, I believe. And uh, it's really a shame that I pulled the plug on it because. There's really nothing else like it out there. I always find it a shame when unique things get don't get the credit they deserve. Oh, this should be another house, so we should get another NPC to move in soon. Might take a while though. The merchant is rather lazy. You have enough money, you have more than a gold coin, so should close the door. I think gonna come in. Also, I really like the guitars. Both the group is Japanese, but the game was Korean. Uh, yeah, BBO music is Japanese, just like that, huh? Obviously. Oh. That's not a good reference, is there? I haven't listened to most of these tracks before, you know, so I don't know what to expect. This could go horribly, horribly wrong. In all sorts of colourful ways. Yeah. Look at another set. I don't even need the grey bricks, I'm making my walls out of red bricks. Yeah. And I put a lot of grey bricks for the variety. Oh, we've got more. Let's have a full stack. Well, almost a full stack there. Oh, this sounds a lot like something else. Get out of my study! Oh, what is to be a study? Now it's just a place for floating eyeballs to hang around. Get out of here! There. Happy not here? Damaged. No fault for hanging around here. Some of them are dead. Oh, you did just. There. I was dead. Should take care of my this for a while. So yes, let's complete the construction of this floor. And yeah, we don't really have to worry about the eyes anymore here. Actually, you can actually construct while being bothered by enemies and not being hit at all by continuously constructing only one tile at a time. However, that is a very, very, very Long winded way of dealing with stuff. Also, I just built thing a room of twelve, didn't I? Yeah, we're gonna expand that to thirteen. Cause I like symmetry. We're gonna dig it one tile larger. 
glad I did that now and I determined I needed to do that after my tower was completely finished. That would have been horrible. Oh, already complete, alright. Put this thing in the middle. And I guess right again. Wonderful. Right. Let's build the glass. That's what I mean with the construction method. No. It's very useful in a corruption to use that there. Obviously it's very slow, so I'm not going to show that. It's even more slow than what I've done so far. But I'm, I'm, we're going quite fast now, from now on, because we're going to have a lot more rooms now, and uh, we have all this stone to work with, basically. Not waste any of that stone. Still don't have that much. I've got the stack to work with. Should be enough to fill up the remaining rooms. Now we have a lot of rooms. If we put a table and a chair in each, we get a lot of NPCs in our building. Two apartments so far. Yes, high speed Omega. Let's put the doors in. That is a terrible place for a door. I'm sorry. It was not supposed to be happening. I just threw a door and didn't die in here. Oh, I guess this looks kind of nice as well. It's perfect for a toilet and a bath. At least I hope I can fit both in. We're going to need a large roll of stuff. We should test that out. Fit the bath on the floor as well, and it doesn't fit though, so... I don't know if I should deal. I'm going to have the toilets up there though. It looks cool. Okay. Wonderful. We have windows, we have doors, we have makeshift chandeliers for now. We have enough metal left over. I don't need to use for equipment, I can make a really long which is kind of awesome. There. Put another table in here. Another chair. The merchant has arrived. You know how there he is. I can talk to him. And we can sell my blowpipes for twenty silver. It's actually quite a lot for the blowpipe. Save one. If you ever need one for something, I can sell a boomerang because I have two. He doesn't pay much for the glow sticks, so I'm not going to sell those. He pay for copper bars. A lot, actually. He likes his bars. Also, lenses. 
so I'll throw that in, so it's quite nice. I need that many lenses right now, I don't know so many, I can you need lenses for that, it's probably the only thing you use it for, so I sell my lenses. And some of the other stuff probably too, I have it there. And I have enough gold, I can buy one of those helmets for him, from him, or for him. <laughs> He's not going to get my helmet. He just sold it to me, the bastard, for a little gold. Oh yeah, let's see if I can get myself a bath, not uh, just a toilet. I'll just get a toilet anyway. We need sanitation. It has been researched. Because they're completely... Oh, it's actually only one tile. A tiny little toilet. Let's build against the wall. Should be okay. It's another room. It looks completely unstable right now. I think I could build a pillar under here and it would look awesome. Shall we build the secret toilet pillar? Oh, not yet. I don't have a stone for it though. First, let's build. Let's correct this because it looks like something has fallen there. So, we're running on some windows here and there. Now this part of the elevator is the elevator, which will be basically just a straight drop down. Okay, now I need a better hammer to hammer out all of this dirt so I don't get stuff spawning in my elevator, which would be annoying. I can make a copper hammer, but that's not really good enough for me. I don't want a silver hammer or something along those lines. Yes, after after iron comes silver. And then gold! Oh yes, gold! Let's make ourselves a copper chain mail. Sounds like a good use for the copper. Yeah, it's two more defense. Now we got three defense. I look like a real buff guy now. Yeah. Especially the armor, of course. Copper bricks, no thank you. Grey bricks. Yes, why not? I always use more grey brick walls. I can also use another pair of chair and table for the study. Probably also some more items or on the table. I was maybe some candles or something. Maybe like a desk over here. We want a piano in here as well. 
I don't know why. There. It's one more room complete. I might even get another NPC for that. Oh, there's more bricks that can be put on here. Or maybe there's one section of wall missing here somewhere. Oh, they have to have a door to the outside world or something silly. Which there isn't, because it's an apartment complex. Duh. Dab. Oh, so this looks real stupid, so let's get rid of that. And replace it with proper walls. Build more apartments over here, like a like a world apartment, like and then above that sky bridge. Something, and you don't know where the sky islands are there, because so I build at the right height. You don't miss out on the sky islands. I don't really know how I need to go. I'm about the front line or so. This this background moves up slowly when you go up, so this just goes from light blue all the way to black. Oh, it does. Oh, we got one section of the elevator. I can actually drop, drop down safely for now. Not for long, though. As you can see, this is a very slow way of going up and down now. It's not the fastest way you can go up in this game, though. Okay. Store our low pipe in here. Night away push. Okay. Arrows in the arrow pocket. Yeah. We can construct additional building stuff. Make our two floor apartment over here. Yeah. Don't even know what I'm all going to put in it, but it's going to be the luxury apartment. See there. Because I want to have a double ceiling, so I'm going to have a large lower floor, five tiles, then one tile ceiling, and then a small tile of upper floor. Oh wait, I got 12 tiles to work with, right? So this is five tiles. Nine, ten. It would be eleven. The top will be 12. Let's see if I get that right. Yes. This is actually going to be the height of the ceiling. It's like three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven tiles. You have to work with. So I have like ten tiles on the inside. Yeah, that's completely correct. This is exactly the right height. See, I want to build a staircase, probably in the first bit, so... I'm not going to have windows, though. I want to have my windows. No, wait, I can have my windows. It's going to be very sneaky about it. And actually, if I dig out this square as well, 
and make the ceiling one thick in a little part above the door here. Like this, I can still have my window, and it'll look still. It'll look awesome. It'll be like a real upper floor of an apartment. Build the supporting walls for now. All being supported by the one turn off glass which can't be good. Alright. I can do that again over here I want it. dark again. Let's quickly complete the ceiling. Objective done. Ceiling complete. And let's continue our building and get the next NPC in the next installment. Stop music for now.